First with the Mets down by three. So if you pitch a pitcher, how do you approach him? And a balk has been called against Blyer. Didn't come to a full stop. And McNeil goes to second base. Yeah, he's arguing pretty good, but he didn't come full set. But now this this is interesting because it's six to three. They have an open base. Let's take a look here. His hands haven't quite come set. I've seen I've seen uh, more of a balk not get called. So, but it still was a balk. But here it's interesting because rather have Vientos against the righty or Volga back against the lefty. That one pours in for a strike, and it's two and one. Another ball called. Wow. So take that pitch away, take a strike away, and if the second balk of the inning, a flyer who had never committed a balk in his major league career before tonight, and now he's committed two in the course of one at bat. You are not allowed to argue a balk. It's automatic ejection. So he's got to watch himself. Mattingly's going to come out. He can't say anything to the umpire. It's two for three in his career against Blyer. Yeah, that's a strike. He thought it was low. And he called yeah. another balk. So he balks in a run. And now it's six to four. Three balks in the inning committed by Richard Blyer. I have never seen anything like that in my life. And now Donnie's going to get himself thrown out. Not only that, he, he just got thrown out. Strike. Home plate umpire Ryan Blakey threw him out. You're not allowed to argue a balk, but Donnie had seen enough after three balks in a row. Yeah, this one on Blyer. Make a difference. Make you got to change something. I understand his argument, but he has to change it. The umpire's already called it once, then he called it twice. You have to do something different. I've never seen that before. I know in 1987 when they emphasized the balk, there were lots of guys getting called for balks who had never been called before, but I've never seen a pitcher who had never balked in his career get called for three in the course of one at bat. That's just beyond the pale, and you can understand why Donnie, in his last week of managing the Marlins, is going to get his money's worth here. I don't blame him here. And again, this is a that's a strange time for an umpire to put his stamp on the game for something like this. You know what I mean? The it's a four game. The bases are empty, and it's a three and one count to Alonzo. Here's the third balk on replay. Look at his glove. See if it comes set or if it's still moving. <laughs> I don't really see it. That's pretty borderline. Yeah, I don't really see it. I don't know.